In this week's blog, we're doing something I've never done before. This will be a blog unlike any other you have ever seen. I'm gonna take you on a paddle boarding journey. Let's go. Look, it's been four weeks since coronavirus lockdown and quarantine and you know I've spent the last several weeks in Florida and I know a lot has been taken away from us during all of this but let's not focus on that let's not focus on what we may have lost during the coronavirus let's focus on the things we've gained like we may have lost our ability to meet in person have team meetings, to sit down face to face with our clients, or do events, or go to bars, or restaurants, or out shopping, or, or just things like go to the park. Little things that we might do every day but take for granted. But what have we gained? And I think one thing we've gained is a lot of time. If you approach this with the mindset of, I can do things more efficiently, or just because I have to do things differently doesn't mean I have to stop what I'm doing. If you approach it that way, this is a huge gain of time. Let me walk you through some of the ways we've gained time. We don't have to travel face to face right now. We don't have to travel to meet people face to face. We don't have to commute to work, many of us. Right, so we've, we've saved hours in the car, or stuck in traffic, going from meeting to meeting. is what are you going to do with that extra time? One of the things that I've done more is to get out on the paddleboard. This is something I'm doing in addition to all my Ironman training and I can do it even though our business is still going strong, even though we're working harder than ever because I've gained several hours back a day. And I'm committed to using those in ways that will fuel my mind, body, and spirit. To me, this is such an opportunity and it represents so many things in life that I love. It kind of reminds me of when I first learned to ski five years ago at a Tony Robbins conference. I'd never done it before. I get to this conference and I see people out there on the slopes and it just looks awesome. Right, so I decided to, to do it. The first day, it was bumpy. I barely knew how to get my boots on. Right? I, I fell more than I, I spent more time on the ground getting up than I did skiing. Second day, you know, I was starting to put together some turns and kind of figure it out. By day three, I was up and running. And even though I spent a bunch of, a bunch of time on the ground and falling, I learned from it. I discovered this, this, this thing that was awesome, this chance to get out in nature, which I believe feeds your spirit and your soul and to challenge myself mentally, physically. And that's exactly what paddleboarding does. I had never done this a few years ago, and you know, all of a sudden, I, I, we got this place down in Florida, and bought a paddleboard, and that you know, first time out there, I was falling left and right. And eventually, I was you know, able to get out there and, and do some turns and, and, and really have some fun. You know, I know we've lost a lot, but if we focus on what we gain and if we focus on how to use that correctly, we have so much opportunity. Now, I'm not saying you gotta go work 80 hours a week and it's, it's gotta be just work, 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 right? I, I think like paddle boarding, you gotta find balance in life. You need time to work on your business. You need time to work on your financial situation be able to generate the income that helps fuel an amazing life. But you can't do that at the sacrifice of losing your health, both physically and mentally. Another thing that I love about being out here on the paddleboard is it reminds me of so many business situations. Take this route I'm paddling, for example. You know, every day I get out here, I go around this island. I, I go in the intercoastal. But every day, I'm in a different body of water. 
the waves are different each day. The current is different each day. The wind is different each day. In other words, I'm facing a different situation, a different challenge. Even though it's similar to what I may have seen, it's different and I have to adjust. And you have to do the same in business. Another thing I love about paddleboarding is it is impossible to come out here and to not have an attitude of gratitude. I mean, when you get out on the water and can get physical exercise in and stare at beautiful island and trees and nature and you know see amazing waterfront homes and watch awesome boats go by, it's impossible to not have gratitude. I think it's more important than ever right now to focus each and every day on what you have and not on what you don't have. So use the time we're facing right now. Use this challenging period in our history to be grateful, to learn new skills, to get better at your existing skills, to fight for your clients, to fight for your family and your community. Use this time to become a better you. Are you ready to spend a little time out on the water with me? Let's go.